really pleased here at UVA to offer a stereotactic laser ablation. What that means is that we're able to do surgery in a minimally invasive fashion. With epilepsy now, we're able to use laser to very precisely uh, ablate areas of the brain that cause seizures. We use all the latest uh, techniques and advances with imaging uh, to do this. And that, that involves MRI guidance, it's kind of like a GPS system for the brain where we can very precisely introduce uh, electrodes or a laser right to a very small, deep-seated area of the brain, then treat it. Uh, one of the reasons why I'm really interested in this, uh, this technique and technology is it, it, it fits with our interest here at UVA for image-guided brain surgery. Now that means really using MRI in the operating room to visualize and uh, confirm what we do, whether it's removing a brain tumor or doing a treatment deep inside the brain with a laser. We're able to uh, monitor these treatments with MRI in real time, which really improves the safety of the, of the surgery that we do. And, and the, uh, the MRI guided operating room here at UVA is a very unique resource that we have for patients. You know, as, as the procedures become more advanced and improved uh, for the patients, more technology is required. And, and in this procedure, we're utilizing three different technologies. Um, it obviously requires experts in each of those fields uh, to really obtain the optimal or maximal result that we can from each of the different technologies. So surgery for one patient may involve several different types of experts for the treatment. There's obviously a lot of conceptual advantages or theoretical advantages to uh, laser ablation in a minimally invasive way. And now we're starting to have more and more uh, clinical research demonstrating the same types of clinical outcomes with faster recovery times and, and lower risks of side effects. So uh, this is really being adopted nationwide uh, for the treatment of epilepsy and, and brain tumors.